Annyeong everyone, this is Ju from Soju Cars and today we have the very new Terry Tigo 2 Pro and this is the CVT variant, 818,000 pesos while the 5-speed manual costs 708,000 pesos they all come with 5 years warranty, 3 years free roadside assistance, 1 year free PMS very solid for the price unless you are a diehard fan of manual I suggest you get the CVT because you have so much bells and whistle yes yes i really like this car's package i'm not 100 percent sure but there will be promo in the future better deal stuck in the traffic but since we have brake hold system that i originally thought didn't have it has it here on the screen okay. wireless charging and auto hold you can also turn it off but i love it so i will always leave it on and also i thought this car didn't have keyless entry system i thought it only had remote key and i said Oh, it has push start button meaning it's the car is sensing the car so why don't we make it keyless entry system then to my surprise when the car was delivered then i went to see the car Haba, it has a proximity sensor so this is how the key looks like you see it's blinking because it has proximity so if i go away it locks like that but it has a follow me home feature but when i go near you see the side repeater it opened the door nice it has proximity sensor. What's also nice is you also have a place here just to put something and for your bag. And this leather, I like this place so much. So good. Okay, it looks good in the Jollibee drive through. Very good. Like the lights. I like the rims. The repeater looks good also. And the rear looks also good. Oh, and also like, I like this. I want to see this. One thing maybe I want to upgrade is the headlight. It's in halogen, but when the daytime running light is on without the halogen headlight, it looks great with the checkered flag design of the DRL. Blends very well in the checkered flag grille. How about turn radius? Make a U-turn and then we just try with the echo first. Ready, set, go! <laughs> you see, because this CVT, how it the, uh, behaves is... It's like so good! <laughs> the RPM needle stays at 6,000 RPM. It just stays there. And then it shifts. And then, like, uh, it doesn't put down the RPM. It just goes and goes and goes. But it just stays, maintains the RPM. Oh, yeah. Uh, if you just, like, foot the pedal to the metal, then that's the time, yeah, it will, like, have some kind of a delay. So that's echo mode. Let's try sport mode. So, more grunt, two, one, wow, you see, you don't feel the lack of power, yeah, it's also probably emotional because of the engine's grunt, it's trying its best really, and because it's four cylinder, you have more confidence to actually push the car, because it's four cylinder, it's not the three cylinder, which is. Uh, I haven't personally experienced it breaking down, but it could happen. Four, five, six thousand. You see? <laughs> it's not slow. I don't know what happens beyond 100, but at least below that. You don't feel it's slow or it's lacking in power. It's good. Good job. It's okay. Let's go one more time. Okay, press. Oh yeah, and we have the manual mode. It's really holding on to that gear. Wow. When you downshift, it really holds on to that. <laughs> you can have fun in this car. 
I'm so happy, you know. This is very well packaged because sometimes when it's in that price point, you get to lose a lot of things. But Cherry Auto Philippines managed to bring a very well packaged car for a very good price. Oh, wow. It also comes with reverse camera. So the reverse camera quality is um, also with guided lines. It's not the best quality, but and also it has sensor. Many of the um, legacy brands would omit either the camera or the sensor or the trajectory lines or guidelines that move. But this full package and the aircon is so good. You know, like if I were to like push the car like this, most likely the aircon will like go warm and something like that. But voila, it's just doing its thing. Yeah, this car might not have the digital instrument cluster, uh, adaptive cruise control, but uh, we don't really expect an adaptive cruise control in this price point. But it has a manual cruise control nevertheless. And then when you are driving in the Tiptronic, it's actually good. <laughs> it's like a jet ski, you know? It doesn't shift down, so the RPM just stays the rpm stays i like that very much thank you very much as you can see android auto apple carplay wireless crazy stuff crazy stuff so i guess in the future this will become digital look at the speakers there so ways music setting Amazing, right? So my verdict is it's a very well packaged good looking car with good warranty, good price and backed up by the premium preserve warranty package. Also, you know, Three years ago, four years ago, everybody would say, oh, let us wait and see if uh, this disposable car will be, you know, still in the market and will the brand still stay? Not like before. They are still here. They are alive and kicking and they are very happy to get you as their clients. So my verdict is that if your budget is around that point, this, you will not get wrong with this. Easy to drive, easy to park. The ground clearance is good. They didn't, you know, put heated seat or, you know, sunroof just to increase the price, which is also good, right? They just placed the features that we need. I'm very happy that we have a wireless charger here in a very nice spot. Great job, Cherry Auto Philippines. Thank you for watching, everyone. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So please do check out the Tigo 2 Pro in the nearest Cherry dealership. Please watch my walk around video so that you can see what are the parts that it has and the material and all and with that i'll see you in the next video may your dreams come true everyone